you're looking for a car, recreational vehicle, or a home, Central Minnesota Federal Credit Union works to keep rates low and provides quality service to make borrowing easy. Hello, I'm Brian Ottman. I'm here to uh, introduce the uh, 2009 Recori Fast Pitch team. That's pretty exciting. We're, we've only really lost, uh, we lost a number of seniors, but the one major position was our shortstop, Melanie Hilsgen, who went on to play at St. Cloud State. Uh, otherwise, we have everybody returning, pitchers, catcher, and bar uh, anybody not getting injured, we should uh, be right up there in the conference. Uh, in the CLC, anything can happen. It's a, it's a real tough conference. Uh, I know Alexandria also has uh, everybody coming back, as does uh, Brainerd, so uh, it could be anybody's game this year. Well, it's kind of interesting. We are going to, last year, we, uh, like you did say earlier, we, we were one game away from state, we lost to Becker, so we're setting up a scrimmage with Becker before the season actually starts. We're going to do an indoor scrimmage on April 3rd at the St. Cloud uh, Dome with three teams, Maple Lake, Maple River, and Lester Prairie. Uh, starting the conference on April 9th, we have uh, Fergus Falls at home. They're, they're always a very, very tough team early in the year. We have uh, Alexander and Brainerd right after that. So uh, with those teams right away and to see, if, uh, see where we measure up, of course, we'll see them both second time through also. What's inter interesting, you should talk about home runs this year. This year, the state did require all teams to move their fences into uh, between 190 and 220. We did have our fence moved into 200 this year. And yeah, that'll change the game, no doubt. There won't be those game gappers in the outfield that are going to allow the girls just to run around the bases. We do have the power with our bats as well as other teams, so we'll, it'll be interesting to see our, how our team handles that pressure of, of the game changing that little bit. Yeah, right now, last year we had April Cervantes who uh, ended up injuring herself beginning of the season, was not able to play till way at the end. We mainly used her as a base runner. So she could fill either the shortstop position or first base. Kelly Bierman filled in on that spot and earned it, continued to play well in that position. Uh, our uh, pitcher, Sadie Funnenstein, Sam Wenz, going to be sharing the duties on the mound. Tracy Thielen returning, senior catcher, very potent uh, arm. Uh, nobody feels safe on the bases with her, not just stealing the second. She's very good at firing over to third for people trying to do that. Uh, the juniors, uh, Jordan Hansen, Stacy Schwiel, that's second base, third base, uh, doing very, very well. Kelsey Ottman, Chelsea Stang. I mean, we've got, we got just a number that are going to really make it happen this year. I personally am very excited for this year. And like I said earlier, if we uh, don't have a major key injury, I think uh, Ricori could be very interesting to watch this year. My name is April Cervantes and I've been play playing softball since I was in third grade and I'm a first baseman. Um, I'd have to say last year softball we made it really far in our tournament and stuff even though I didn't get to play and stuff because I had a broken thumb but I still had really a lot of fun of cheering my team on. I'm Sadie Funnenstein and I've been playing softball since the third grade and I am the pitcher. I think um, this year one of our biggest goals is going to be to go farther than we did last year and that's going to involve um, winning against Becker we believe at this point so our goal is to at least um, get to play them. Hi I'm Kelly Bierman. I'm a senior. I play first base and I've been playing softball since elementary school. I enjoyed we have a summer softball team so that was a lot of fun and just going to the tournaments and hotels and all just bonding with the team is a lot of fun. Yes, we would. We'd love to have fans coming. We have um, eight starters returning from last year if everything goes well, so it should be fun. Fifteen years ago when I started coaching here, uh, from baseball to softball, I always wondered why I would do that, but this game is a fun, exciting game to watch. Our uh, stands just aren't big enough lately.